Every time I walk in the shed, I see that face. And it's really cute. Always late for breakfast. Look at this little box of chips. You guys are definitely gonna try and run out of here. Boop. Oh my goodness, you guys are crazy. I don't think that they can get out. But I guess we'll see. Update on the chickies. I moved them to this crate yesterday, and uh, as I was leaving for work, they decided to escape a little bit through the bars. I thought that the bars were tiny enough so that they wouldn't get out, but I, st <laughs> I stand corrected. Um, I think that's the phrase, but... Uh, so I blocked around the sides with some tote covers, and it's working pretty well. They haven't escaped yet. I gave them two options for water because the bigger water looked like it was too tall for now. So I've been giving them the tiny one. Well, it's a food one, but um, tiny one and the big one. Gentle. <laughs> you win. So I am recording my little, look, I feel like I'm really fancy because I'm recording myself record stuff. It's, you know, it's what the cool kids do, I guess. I put some nice little lights into my little shed. You can kind of see. It's a little, she's a little pretty. She's a little pretty, look at that. Yeah, I had these like little canopy lights that I, had lying around and I was like, well, the shed is really dark and I don't have any like actual light that I can really hook up out here because there's no electricity. And also my, my laptop dies so fast. So I have limited time out here. I am always stuck with a ton of sourdough discard and I don't know what to do with it half the time. It's actually really good for chickens, just like it's so good for us. Yeah, they, they love to eat this right up in their chicken feeds.